Okay, if your Tesla Model 3 or Model Y was built after January 11th, 2022, you are going to use the AMD plug. If not, you're using the Intel, and that's what we're going to show you how to connect now. The Intel processor connection cord. Okay, once you release the panel or remove the panel under the glove box, here's what we have. We have three plugs. The middle plug, you're going to watch this right now. We're going to reach in there and we're going to release the pin or the locking clasp by pressing in with a screwdriver or in this case a pick. But watch this. As you push it in and pull down, the middle plug of the three will release and then you can slide it right out. Okay, now all that's left to do is to connect this to the female end of the Intel plug. And once you connect it, then you're gonna have an open male end. So remember, you're using the narrower plug, the Intel plug, not the wider AMD, which is in my left hand. Now we're going to insert the Intel plug back up into the computer. So again, sorry, this is very hard to film, but we're going to show you how you're going to insert it the same way you just removed it. So get up inside. It'll go right back in the same second location and we will pop it right in. And then we will proceed with the connecting of all of the hardware like you watched in the first video and your dashboard display cluster will light up, power up and everything will be all set. Any questions, call us, but you'll notice that it is quite difficult to get a hand in there, not to mention a camera when we're trying to light it. But once you make the connection, you'll know because the connector pins will lock in place and it won't come loose and again don't forget to do this with the computer off so go into your settings for safety and turn the computer off and then you can reboot it if you have to